How do molar constrictions like U2 compare to the original designation of constrictions like light modified? Okay, so basically when choke was defined, um, I don't remember what year it was, but it was certainly back in the day when they created that or basically defined choke, we were using much older ammunition with inferior components, fiber wads, um, fixed choke barrels that were not as equivalent or efficient as the one. The reason that I call my chokes U0, U1, U2, U3, U4 is exactly that reason. I didn't want to put improved cylinder or light modified or modified or full choke on a choke when it doesn't pattern the way that patterns are defined from so I call it a U2 because of what I just explained. I don't really care about percentages because that percentage is just a very wide approximate value. It's not accurate and it's not consistent with all guns, nor is it accurate to chokes, nor is it accurate to bore diameters, nor is it accurate. Jimmy Muller has an extensive video library of highly educational full-length videos available for you at MullerChokes.com. Learn revolutionary information from an expert in shotgunning and wing shooting, who also has years of testing and knowledge through the invention and manufacturing of patented space-age choke tubes. You'll find myth-busting and rare content for beginners and experts alike in both target and wing shooting. Learn about patterning, choke tube selection, best ammo choices, ballistics, shotgun choices, how to tackle specific targets, and much more. Sign up now to get your advantage by going to MullerChokes.com.